everybody and welcome to my kitchen. I'm joined today by a very special guest in the shape of Mark Ferris. Round of applause everybody, yay! Um, today we're baking, it's a baking with Jim and Mark. And Mark, what are we baking? Today we're going to be baking from Tanya's new book, mm -hmm. Tanya Bakes, Salted Nutella Cookies. These are incredible, yeah. um, I've had them already. Uh, this is my wife's book, it's very good, she made all the recipes, she made the book, um, you should definitely go buy it. Um, and you should definitely make these from it because they're amazing. What do we need, Mark? Right, you're gonna need... It's all there. Oh, okay. <laughs> you're gonna need greaseproof paper. Yes. Some unsalted butter. Correct. Butter. Some sea salt flakes. Mm -hmm. You're gonna need some self-raising flour. Some white caster sugar. Yeah, you're good at this. <laughs> I can read it. <laughs> some eggs and... The biggest tub of no You don't no need to be that big. No. Tom just bought a massive one. Um, you were telling me how many calories? 5,400 in this? Yeah. And that's how many Big Macs? Five Big Macs. Right, so what is first? Preheat the oven to 180. I'll do that because you don't have to use my oven, do you? Okay. Line two baking trays with greaseproof paper. Lucky there's two of us. Yeah. Baking tray each. I feel like I'm on a, um, like a cooking show. Do you? Because I usually cook like, on like a long strip. Right. Oh yeah, I've seen yours. This is weird. Baking with Jim ain't no cooking show. I can guarantee yeah. you that. <laughs> but this is like proper with an island and everything. Well, you say that, but you can still kind of see a bit of fish skin on this, uh, <laughs> on this baking tray. So, <laughs> not that professional. Do you ever do that thing where you put a bit of butter on the, on the tray so it sticks to the greasy paper? No. You've never done that? That's a good idea. You don't know anything about I, it. I don't know anything in general. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of like baking glue. That's a good idea, actually. Yeah, I found it out from somebody else's videos. <laughs> but I'll take the credit. And it should... It's like PVA. It should now slip into paper now. If it doesn't, then I'm going to be embarrassed. <gasps> kind of works, right? Yeah! Cream together the butter and sugar until the lights come fluffy. Now, the butter and sugar is 200 grams of softened, unsalted uh, butter and 300 grams of caster sugar. I need a knife. A little knife, please. Hold on there. I'm coming. Don't go to that's so in my head now. I know, sorry. <laughs> I love you just the way you are. Well, that's 34 grams, got a long way to go. <laughs> I feel like it's going to be a whole loaf. <laughs> a whole loaf. <laughs> a loaf of butter. Yeah, it's trying to give me a whole loaf of butter. 188. <laughs> Should I just put it all in? No, because that's, I think it's 250 in here. Ooh. Ah, 212. So yeah. Fine. Yeah, we'll go with it. Now we need uh, 300 grams of caster sugar. Okay. Do you want to do this bit? Okay, you don't trust yourself, do you? It's <laughs> not with pouring. We might not have enough in this bag. We might do. Perfect. Oh, dude, good. That's a hot that is that was exactly what was in there. Perfect. Very happy with that. Now, cream together uh, until light and fluffy. So we need a wooden spoon. Where is that? This is a new kitchen, so I'm not sure where anything is. Hey, wooden spoon. Hey. There you go. Okay. Oh, this is hard. You're doing great. Thanks. In the meantime, I'm going to weigh out some um, flour for you. Okay. We need um, 325 grams of self-raising flour. Oh, I love the smell of un, like, done butter. Do you know what? One thing I found, <laughs> undone butter. <laughs> yeah. Do you know what? You should have a YouTube channel. You're really good at work. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Cream together, that's butter and sugar until light and fluffy. Okay. That ain't light and fluffy, son. <laughs> no. Do you want to have a little stir? Smells <laughs> <laughs> like mashed potato. I think we get some. See, that looks amazing. You did most of it. I just, just took the glory from you, that's yeah. all. <laughs> all right, now we crack an egg. Yeah, mix in the egg. There's only one egg, so you just chuck the egg in. Okay. Um, and then gradually add the flour and salt until the dough forms. And the salt is just one teaspoon. Come on, you got this. Okay. You totally got this. There you go. Like a pro! Woohoo! Oh, it's getting squelchy. Let's start gradually adding in the flour. Okay. Shall I stir in you pour? stir and I shall gradual. I shall gradual. <laughs> I haven't got a very good wrist, have I? Uh, yeah, practice. This is really quick. It is so yeah. quick. I mean, it's much it? quicker if you weren't doing it. <laughs> but it, it's a really good recipe if, uh, if you're not mad. Killing it. Killing the game. Do you want to swap? Yeah. <laughs> Woo! That's my workout. All of it? Yeah. Why not? Ta da! Oh my god, you're doing this by hand with a wooden spoon. <laughs> Is that not what you're supposed to do? <laughs> I've used the kitchen aid. Oh, I never use the kitchen aid. I feel like I'm not allowed to use it. <laughs> Add Nutella and gently marble the chocolate through the dough using a wooden spoon or a palette knife. Okay. 200 grams of that stuff. Nope. 
going to fall in it. It's your first time in it. Pretty much, yeah. Have you never had it before? No. This is going to blow your mind. I know, I've like, it's been a while. If you've never had Nutella really properly before and you like to have it in a cookie. Mm. Here's the dough, by the way, if you're interested. It's, it's good. Yeah. Right, ready? Right. Yeah. Oh no! What? Oh, do we need to marble it in? Do, yeah, what does that mean? It's very sticky. I don't know why I thought it'd be runnier. Why am I such a Nutella virgin? Mmm, right. Marble. Hello, baby. You want to see some marbling in action? Look. Look how good this is, Martha. That's really good. <laughs> She's like, Uncle Mark, you're the best. <laughs> Let's make them with your cookies. Yay! Right. I'm going to wash my hands because I've touched the dog and she's disgusting. <laughs> Divide the dough into ten balls, then squash them down gently onto the baking trays. No, that's, that's too small. I reckon that's about half, do you think? Yeah. Okay. Mm. Now we just had uh, Tom come downstairs and say make sure when you make them into cookies you give them enough room because apparently they grow. Look at that marble. Oh, oh yeah. Look at that big one. <laughs> that's a beast. We should have like three baking trays because According to time, these things really spread. Shall we? Well, I haven't got another baking tray, so no. <laughs> <laughs> Done. Throw them down. They're looking so good, though. Don't they? And then what do we do with the salt? Oh, we put the salt in! <laughs> <laughs> no, wait. wait, I feel like... We forgot to add the salt. Let's just put a little tiny bit of salt in each one. Yeah, that sounds good, like, make it a hole. <laughs> When you make a hole, what I'm gonna do is get a bit of salt and just kind of mix in with But you, you oh. go for a hole, that's fine. <laughs> Whoa, it's only it's only oh. one teaspoon of salt in the whole mixture. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Each one gonna get a little tiny bit like that. No one will ever know. No one will ever know. <laughs> apart from me are filming this. <laughs> so everyone will know. Right, so now I've kind of added salt in there. It's gonna really form it. Alright. 12 minutes. See you later! Good luck, fellas. See you on the other side. Siri, set time at 12 minutes. I think that went well. That's time! Yay! Let's open her up and have a look. That was the longest 12 minutes ever. It smells so good. Oh, they're massive! <laughs> oh, oh, aren't they huge? Why are they so big? They're like bloody pies. Oh my goodness. Oh, mine are even bigger. They are done, Jim. Holy, they're not done? They are done. Yeah, I think you're right. A little bit longer, I think. Another few minutes because uh, <laughs> they're huge. They look like a cross section of an elephant's foot. Yeah. <laughs> so massive. <nasty. laughs> okay, so we gave them an extra two minutes, and I reckon that they're just about done now. As much time has passed, and these are much cooler now. Um, when you first get them out of the oven, they're a bit kind of flimsy. And yeah. um, Tarn came and ate part of one of them. That's why that one kind of has a big part missing. <laughs> Let's try it. Oh my god. Mm. How good is that? Oh my god. I love this, Hella. And that just, I love cookies. It's everything you need. I feel like we did overcook them slightly. Yeah. Um, it says 12 minutes. And we thought we were being big and clever, but going, no, they're not cooked yet. 12 minutes is all they need. Yeah. I'm happy. Mm. Good. Cheers. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you liked it, then give it a thumbs up. Make sure if you do recreate these, uh, use the hashtag baking with Jim. And also tag Tarn tag Mark because um, I made them with Mark and they're Tarn's cookies. Uh, also, we did a video on Mark's channel, which is really good. We played um, Obama Llama, which is this game here. Um, he's still eating, so I'm going to keep talking. <laughs> so go over there and subscribe because he's brilliant. Um, and all that stuff. What else do I need to say? That's it, right? Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Happy baking. Happy baking, and I will see you very, very soon. Goodbye. Bye.